Hey, uh, and welcome back to the Starbound Let's Play video series. I think we're in part 9 or something like that. But regardless of what part we're in, the last part, I got pretty far down. I got to where the sand and the gravel are, and that's what's up. I hope everybody's having a great day. If you're not, I'm glad to be here to entertain you. If you are, more power to you. Let's have it. Let's, let's go ahead and uh, get on it here couple things I noticed about this game first of all you are very sensitive to temperature and it matters where you are that's science so if I'm down in the cave you can see the temperatures drop somewhat and uh, I, I notice but in other parts where uh, where it's warmer like if I go next to the torch I can warm up see see my temperature goes up here and I'm okay then yay so that's kinda cool I like that uh, it's it's an interesting uh, uh, mechanic, survival mechanic, as it were. Okay, so basically I'm just going to go out uh, guns blazing here, get these chests, get my 12 pixels, and then kind of dig this a little bit and get that uh, poison to drain some more into that place. So in order to do that effectively, uh, we're going to put this bloke here. I'm gonna dig out the top portion. I have a little standing pad. There we are. And we'll dig out these so that the poison is put in this place. And the rest of this I can just fill in. There we go. Very nice. There. Get rid of this platform and boink. More pixels. So all that poison is gone. That whole place is dead to me. And now, although I said I could still use it, I'm, I'm having second thoughts. Because I do want to check out... Oh, I hear some dangerousness. Okay, that was nothing. There is... Oh, you know what, though? I really should grab these, uh, these vines. So we're going to put a little plate for them like this and that. Oh, perfecto mundo! Yeah, I'm going to grab these vines. I'm going to grab these two. Because I have a lot of plant fibers. As far as I'm concerned, you can never have too many. I'm up to a hundred. Which is 25 more bandages, which reminds me I should patch up. You notice I've been staying alive a lot longer now that I've been having good bandage management. Try saying that five times fast. Bandage management, bandage management, bandage management, bandage management, bandage management. I did it! I could have done it faster, but uh, I'm not feeling totally 100% articulate today. How many resources do I have anyway? Holy monkey! I got a thousand deer tay here, 558 on me. I got a whole crap ton of cobbledy stone and cobbledy stone. I should really combine these. And why won't they combine? See, that's weird. Why they won't they won't combine like that? It's the same one. I mean, it's the same graphic and everything. Eh. Who knows? Who knows? We're just going to keep on digging. Another thing, well, one thing I should do is, uh, do I have enough for a campfire? Let's see. I should really build another crafting table. I'm going to put it down here. So that, uh, yeah. I, I need to uh, do a couple of things, you know. First things first. Do I have the camphor? Yes. Okay. Craft! I need that to make another forge, you know. There it is. Good. And... Okay. Okay, the reason I'm doing this here is because... Alright, eight... No. What are you doing? Eight place... Clicky, put, there we go. Oh, ah, ah, what the heck? <laughs> I'm doing this because I want to, uh, I want to smelt some of the stuff I have. See, I got more iron here. It's not enough yet. I think I need one more piece. Uh, no, three more ores, and I got it. But I got silver also. If I start collecting these now, when it comes time to make the tools, because I have a lot of pixels, I have enough to do some serious upgrading, and I shout. 
But without this stuff done in the first place, just nice to be prepared, you know, done ahead of time. As well as the copper, because I can uh, investigate some type of armor, you know. And the gold, why not? I'll make a gold bar. I'm gonna need it later. Okay, so... Oh, I have these lanterns, too. And a bed, but I think that's just furniture. I don't think it actually functions as such. So, I need, in order to do this, to make the anvil, I need two more pieces of iron. And I haven't seen a whole lot in the area of, uh, you know, that's, oh, that's what I wanted to check, is to tear up my tools to see if I can get something even better. So, if I want, uh, oh, that's right, the anvil shows me that. Well, then I need that anyway. <laughs> Gotta find some some more iron, just a little bit, just a tiny bit. I probably passed some along the way, I don't remember, but I'm gonna dig through this, this stone, because if I can mine faster, then I can start to really explore in a big way, and that's what we're all about here. We want to make some serious ground, so to speak, and just just tear it up. So, I'm excited about that. Oh, hello, is this a cave opening? It is! Nice. Oh, there's a chest down there. Now, who in the world would bury a chest in the middle of the dirt like that? It doesn't make any sense. But, hey, more money, more problems, right? I hear groaning over, like, to my left. I'm thinking there's some cave over here that I'm about to discover, and uh, things are going to start happening. And I have noticed that the whole time I've been this deep, the cave uh, music has been very serene. It's an interesting... Uh, Interesting audio effect. It's been uh, quite pleasant. It hasn't helped me at all, but it's pleasant. Okay, now we get to cut up gravel. Yay! Goes much quicker this way. But you can bury yourselves. Uh, <laughs> nice. And... Oh, nice! Huge, huge iron deposit in the dirt, man. Jackpot! <laughs> We did it. Finally found what we were looking for. And it looks like we finally found this cave system I've been looking for, too. So that is most excellent. But maybe not. You know, we'll see. I'm just glad that I found all this iron. Because now I have more than enough. And I might be able to make some iron tools. You never know. We're going to find out right now. Oh, crap. Is that a hippo? What is that? Would you like to die today, sir? <laughs> oh, yeah. Come get it. Oh, he dropped some meat. I'll take that. Yeah, I think we found the cave system. <laughs> okay. So, we're going to go back over here quickly. Back to my stuff, you know. And let's go ahead and craft that anvil. Oh, I got to refine the... <laughs> I got to refine the iron first. There we go. Uh, I will just sit back and watch the smelting process. <laughs> ah! I had a little stretch there. Pardon me. All right. So now we can step it up, man. Where do you see this? So we get to Ranville. Well, ah, there it is. Clink. And let's, uh, well, I don't want to block off my, my way, so let's go ahead and get rid of some of these, you know. That's the way. Ah. And I think, uh, uh, well, I, I, oh, I can fit it here. Duh. I'll just put that there. And then put this, where is it? There we go. And then that go there. Boink! Awesome! Alright, I can make the shanker, which is a damage of 6. My item is a damage of 4, so I'll definitely do more damage with that sword. But the bow is really coming through for me now. The silver pickaxe requires the copper pickaxe, so that's what i got to build first. Okay. Oh, iron hunting bow. Oh, my goodness. That could be useful. Well, let's focus on the tool first. I need... What else can I build? Nothing, really. Copper pickaxe. I need just need more copper for that, and I think there's some over here. So let's do that first. Because the better tools I have... Oh, yeah, see, there's some copper right there. I'm going to need more than that, but it's a good start. 
Let me light this up while we're at it. Oh yes, oh yes. We're definitely in resource country now. <laughs> I love it. Let me get these uh, these things too while I'm at it. These chests. Because stuff is going to start getting expensive too. And I'm not about to be no broke joke. Ooh, that's a nice slurry of vines. Let's look up here first. Oh, of course, I get poisoned. The one square where there's poison. In. Oh, what's this? What kind of dirt is this? Is it dirt? Yeah, but it's a different color. <laughs> it's like the different colors of wool in Minecraft. Oh, you dig really fast through this stuff. Man, that goes quick. I'm going to be digging through a uh, rock like that soon, man. You watch. we got some random coal deposits. But first, while we're here, let's grab these bandage makers. There we go. That's good. Okay. There's more poison. We don't want nothing to do with that. But now we get to have an easier time because of uh, all this. Yeah. Aha! There's the copper I'm looking for. I'm gonna have to like, do this kind of thing. I don't know. Spam the dirt so I can get up here. <laughs> That's. Oh uh, yeah. There we go. Squeeze myself in there. Yes, that's it. That is the copper that I seek. It's enough to make a copper pickaxe. See if we can't... Uh... I do like that you get to trade in the tool you had for the next one so you're not carrying a bunch of useless tools with you. That's that's kind of neat. You could make more, I guess, if you wanted to. as like a backup thing, but uh, we found it! Yay! We are at the best... Ah, ah! Poison. No. Stifle yourself. And you! Go away. Okay. Now let's see. Uh, oh, ah, let's see about this tool upgrade, shall we? I'm excited. This is the first time I've done this. Okay, show me what you got, Mr. Anvil. Where's that copper pick? Oh, I, I got a smelt first. <laughs> I'm the smart one. <laughs> <sighs> Making fun of myself. No, oh, no problem. Just, uh... Oh, don't tell me I'm one short. I will rage. Oh! The rage is real! Yeah! One stinking piece, man. One stinking piece. Well, maybe I'll find one around here randomly. There's got to be one around here somewhere. Just one that I can dig up. Has to be. Has to be somewhere. What's that? That's coal. Gotta be so I don't want to go too far from where I am either, but I'm just trying to trying to find my way. That's where I came from. Anything in the walls over here? There's nothing anywhere. These caves are barren, man. Not giving up nothing. Shoot. Well, down there is poison death. Don't want to do that. Let's go ahead and dig through some super easy gravel. See if we can't find anything without burying myself alive, you know. I see some more coal over there, but that's about it. Ah, ah, ah. Aha! I found it! <laughs> oh, there's some right here, too, below my feet. I was looking down at a corner of the screen here. Sweetness! Put a torch so we can see what the heck we're doing. And there it is. Oh, I'm going to have to... Uh, cook up some food too. I'm starving here man! I'm starving! Can I do that in the furnace? I don't remember. Can I? Can I? No, it's got to be the campfire. Okay, well, let me take down this this copper and while that's working I will craft a... or should be able to craft a campfire. I can. Okay, that's done. Put that in the inventory. Oh, I could just place it too, couldn't I? There we go. And E, and where's my food? There it be. And cook away. And while that's cooking, I go into here and get my copper bar. And I go in here and I get, oh, there it is. Bam. Awesome. So now I got the copper pickaxe. Before I go, I'm going to go ahead and try it out.
Oh yeah, a little better, a little better. All I need now is iron too, and I can get the iron one, because the iron, uh, the silver pick, is the copper plus some more silver bars. So we're totally making progress, and uh, that's about all for today. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, dine on some of this delicious alien meat. Oh yeah, and uh, I'll see you in the next video. So if you like this video, go ahead and click that like button, right? there and uh, let me know because I guess it helps so you stay awesome anything if you do anything for the rest of your day and the rest of your life make it be that you stay awesome and I will see you in the next video oh yeah